right, when you're hungry for a burrito, there are so many great options to choose from across the Portland metro area, but one particular food cart definitely stands out. Mm -hmm. Fernando's Alegria in the Portland Mercado is known for their fresh and modern interpretation of classic Mexican dishes. Joining us live this morning is owner Fernando Rodriguez and Ernesto Fonseca, CEO of Hacienda, which helps run the Portland Mercado. Good morning to you both. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So, Fernando, we want to start with you. Tell us about your take on Mexican cuisine, your food cart, what you've been cooking up. Oh, so we've been open here at the Puerto Mercado for five years. Uh, we we have our food like more like traditional from uh, Central Mexico. Uh, we try to create food that it's like you know like it's 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 made from the from our soul. I learned the recipes from my mama, so she's my biggest uh, critic. We try to always do the best and. Uh, always offer like the best experience, customer service, and tasteful food. So hopefully you mm. like what you get. You yeah, know you can't we, beat mom's cooking. <laughs> we, uh, we're putting the salsa on our burritos oh, right yeah. now that, that you sent over. Um, Ernesto, tell our viewers who aren't familiar with the Portland Mercado just about all you have to offer out there in the food carts. Yeah, thank you very much, everyone, and good morning. Well, what can I tell you? The Portland Mercado, we started in 2015 and it's been really, really great adventure to offer not just uh, Latino uh, food, but also, you know, the experience of experiencing the, Latin the Latino culture. Right now we have uh, nine food carts, a little store in uh, and a juice bar, uh, as well as a regular bar in, in the Portland Mercado. So you, you can experience food from Costa Rica, Brazil, Argentina, Mexico. Obviously, another uh, another country such as Colombia. So we're really excited to offer this uh, this uh, wonderful food to the Portland community. It is fantastic. I mean, mm -hmm. when you first walk in there, just the smell—it's heavenly. Oh, the spices and oh, things. It's yeah. so good. It's mm -hmm. so good. Okay, so we're checking out the uh, the chicken tinga burrito. Right. Fernando, it's amazing. It is. It was so good. I it's love this. Once the for feeling. breakfast. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So, and tell us, you sent us a chicken and then some breakfast burritos, and, and you guys really specialize in, in burritos and wraps, right? Yeah, we uh, we specialize in burritos and wraps. Uh, what I sent you, the other one is called the Serena's uh, Special. It's a breakfast burrito with potatoes, wa fresh guacamole, uh, cream, and bacon or chorizo. Mm. And uh, uh, the other one is the chicken tinga. It's like our specialty. It's the shredded chicken. It takes like six hours to cook, like slow cook, but mm. we put a lot, a lot of uh, love into it. So that's probably why you like it. We can taste it. Yeah. Is there a difference tell. between, I put the red sauce on mine. Uh, is that the hotter one of the, the two? Those are both are uh, medium, mild. Okay. So the green, it's a little bit like mild. Yeah. But yeah. we try to make it like, just not too crazy. So yeah, I usually go green because yeah. I'm I'm hoping that it's more more mild. It's more mild. More what yeah. I can handle, but both mm -hmm. it's really great. It's really good. Awesome yeah. flavor. Mm -hmm. um, Ernesto, talk about the importance of supporting you know local businesses and Latino owned businesses. Absolutely. You know, uh, we did this for that very reason. You know, to start you know supporting um, Latino entrepreneurs in the food industry. Uh, all of that had been going quite well until the pandemic hit. Uh, Typically, we we'll receive about 35 to 40,000 visitors every year at the Portland Mercado. And just suddenly out of the blue, you know, we lost between 40 and 70 percent of, of, of our business uh, overnight, literally, uh, last year. So it was a really, really hard time and we had to step it up and find new resources to support our small businesses from cash allowances for business stay, to stay afloat, to forgiving rents, to reducing rents. And obviously to find new partnerships, you know, such as um, the one that probably Fernando is going to be talking a little bit about uh, with the women's Clackamas service to uh, expand, you know, deliveries and, and takeout. Yeah. So it's extremely important for us to support these businesses. As you know, more than 90% of the U.S. economy is supported by small businesses and the food industry is the one that was hit the hardest. Absolutely. Mm, yeah. Now, Fernando, tell us a little bit about this partnership. We've got a little bit of time left. What are you working with this summer? Yeah, so this, uh, thanks to Hacienda, the, they helped us to connect with the Clackamas Women's Services. Uh, we, we, during the pandemic, we were able to like provide food for their shelters because uh, they needed, uh, they were renting like shelters and they didn't have like kitchens. So we were able to offer our food for a whole year. So thank you, thanks to Hacienda, that that was like, it was 
very helpful for us because we were like really struggling. But the, this partnership, it just, it just saved us. It was just, it was just beautiful. Oh, Thank you. Yeah. That's that's that awesome. So that's great. so great to hear because yeah. we definitely want to make sure that food this good is going to stick around in this community for a oh, long definitely. time. Oh, mm definitely. -hmm. Yeah. Well, thanks you guys yeah, for thank joining us. Thank you both us. for joining us. Great to talk with you, Fernando and Ernesta. Good luck with the with the business, with growing things this year. And of course, uh, we'll put all the info that you need on coin.com mm -hmm. because uh, Fernando's Alegria is one of our featured shoes local restaurants. You can go to our website now, enter to win a, a $50 gift card. Yeah. And uh, yeah, you can get a lot of good stuff for that.